Thanks for being with us today. It is the last day of the month, Caroline. Yes, it is. This is Stephen Caroline on, on the, the go. go live, and we are whipping it up. We are today. whipping it up. We're so excited to be with you guys. It seems like forever. Seems like a long time. I know. I'm, I, I kind of forgot how to like put my microphone on. Yeah, and put the microphone and so we have. We're this, not. We're not doing we anchovies. Have a, we have with us right now Hunter uh, Coleman. Talking to us. He's we talking to us Hunter right now. Coleman here. We're live. And uh, we're live. We're live. And he's. Uh, here with his <laughs> and food. our producer is trying to and uh, we've got crowd control because <laughs> we have crowd control we're because we're just so swamped with uh, yeah. everything so, anyway <laughs> we are here they probably know where we are in Carolina yeah we're at the coffee bar we are at the coffee and bar. we have with we us have Miss Susan, um, Susan Bogeman who's that's her head that you're seeing uh, right now she's right in front of the camera she's right in front of the camera if you're, just moved you're to right the in side, front of the camera please. Okay, okay. Uh, and then we also have Bob James here. Yes, and we he's are with us just as well. We're just so uh, active today. We haven't started uh, yet. We haven't started yet, but you are on. We're camera. just saying hello, but you're on camera, so, so say hello to everybody uh, in their say apartments. Hello. Move along, move along. <laughs> All right, thanks for being here. Thanks for being here. <laughs> Ah, so much okay, interest. Okay, wow. All right. Heavens. So it's been a while since yes. we've done, we did the brain chat. Right. So right. that was a show. And then since then, it's been a long time. It has been a long time. Since we've done a show. Yeah. It's been a longer yeah. time since we've done a cooking show. Oh, I know. Longer, longer time. time. Longer but time. But we have producer Ed here. Producer Ed is always with he's us. He's security always with and us. crowd control today. So we've got two recipes today. Yes, two recipes. You want to know what they are? Uh, yes, please tell the us. The first one we're going to do is an olive cream cheese spread. Olive cream cheese So this cheese recipe... Spread. Do you have to like olives to, to eat it? Yes. Okay. Yeah, you have to. Do okay. you like olives? Because I'm... Um, I've grown into them. Yeah. Yeah. Um, or just salty things. Salty things. Because it's kind of... It's savory. Okay. It's a savory dish. So just so savory. Savory. Uh -huh. This was given to me okay. by one of our very own... Yes. Catherine Jeter. Catherine. Yes. Thanks I, so much. I said, Catherine, we want to showcase your mother's recipe. Yes. Her mother made it for her. So we're here so because we're, of Catherine. Because Catherine. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. So what we're going to do first yes. is we're going to take two kinds of cream cheese. Two Plain kinds? cream cheese block. Okay. Which is somebody, sometimes you call it a brick of cream cheese. You're going to put that in the bowl. In my bowl? In your bowl. Okay. And on the counter and oh. everywhere. Just um. I don't know what to do with that. Okay. <laughs> Just <laughs> already we're okay. 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 And then we're gonna take a container of cream cheese, chive, and onion. Mm, chive and, and onion. you're gonna scoop all of that out yes. with the <laughs> I don't think it, I don't think Ed uh, thought he would be doing security and crowd control. <laughs> yeah, this is something <laughs> I didn't. I didn't think about it I'm either. Glad we have him. Yeah, I know. Thanks I'm for being I'm gonna go here, ahead and he's fantastic. Chop, so I'm um, putting the onion and chive. Yep, onion and chive cream cheese in with the plain cream cheese. Okay, real chives. It says real chives and crisp onion and crisp. Uh huh. Onion. Crisp. crisp. Do you crisp. taste how crisp the onion is? Uh, you, you, you get a hint of onion flavor because we're going to put some more onion in that as well. Oh. We're going to grate an onion. Do you like onion? I, I like onion. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it, you'd have to like onion to like this recipe? Well, you're. it's like a hint of flavor. It's oh, okay. not overpowering of onion. Okay. So do you want to shred or do you want me to? Go ahead. Mm. <laughs> Probably going to start crying. Yes. So do you, I fold while you shred? You whip. You can whip that. Oh, I can whip it? Mm-hmm. Like this? With the whipper. Oh, with the whipper. <laughs> with the mixer. <laughs> uh, <laughs> All right, so I'm going to start. Okay. Like while you grating. do that, I do this? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I'm uh, grating. I'm whipping. And this whipping. turns into a very... Woo, I'm going to start uh, crying in a minute. <laughs> Woo, I know I am. I should have let you do this part. Okay, so I think that might be I close. love these bowls, Caroline. Thank They're you. fantastic. Yes, I, I have. Do you like a whole set of them? I do. Different colors? Different colors, different fantastic? sizes. Oh, there's lots of so, juice. So, there's lots of do juice. Do you try to get the juice? Yes, try to get the juice. Mm, and it makes it more oniony. That's going to be enough for today. Okay. Normally, you do two tablespoons, but yes. I'm not doing any more of that. Not, not any more of that, because we don't want Caroline crying no we don't want to be crying <laughs> okay the next okay. thing we're gonna do yeah. is we've got to uh-huh chop our olives oh 
Okay. Now, how long have you loved an olive? I love olives. You do? Love olives. Like forever? Well, I don't... I kind of had a choir and a taste for olives. I've always eaten them, so okay. I've never really thought about it much. Okay. Maybe I didn't have them as a child. Maybe not. Okay. So, we're going to... First, we're going to pour a little bit of juice mm. in with that. Mm, that sounds good. And then we're going to Go pick that. some of these olives out. And... You can go ahead and All start right. chopping. We okay. want to chop these up. Okay. So, and I'll get uh, some more out. Just like a finely chopped. Or like or at least in quarters. Okay, at least quarters. in quarters. Okay. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's fantastic. You want to use about a half a jar of olives, but if you want more or less, more. that is up to you. You can okay, you just, can adjust uh, the recipe to taste to taste mm -hmm. what you like. My wife loves right. olives. Oh well, she'll love this. Yeah, she loves it. <laughs> You're doing a fine job there. <laughs> He's the finest olive Woo! chopper in yes. the land. Okay. All right, so put those in. Put them in? Yep. All righty. Put these olives Slide in. Slide like those that. in. Okay. And let me finish these up yes, real quick. Okay. <laughs> so just. And I'll. Uh, you can put in, in half, a teaspoon half a teaspoon of garlic powder. Okay. Fantastic. Garlic powder. We're doing our cooking show. We're doing our cooking show. Uh, the lady that's behind the, the lady camera. that you may hear Nancy. talking is Claire you Durkin. May hear her talking, but it's Miss Claire Durkin here in our studio audience today. Yeah. John Eskew was here. He was here. He was here. I'm gonna. The next time I see him, I'll ask him why. What? Why didn't I'm he? Watching our show. Why didn't he stay here? <laughs> Okay, mix all uh, that together. Okay, mix. <clears throat> okay. Sweet. Now that is finished. Okay. So what we would normally do, if you're going to serve this at a party, you would um, scrape it down. This, okay. Do you know how to get it off the beaters? Yeah. You do? Mm-hmm. That's what I do. Okay. And then, yes. Just put those in the sink, I and guess. Put them in. <laughs> if you can get it off. Okay, got okay. it. Got it. Put all them right. in the sink. So put then it. you'd scrape all that down. You'd put okay. it in a bowl and you'd set it in the fridge to chill. Put it in a bowl, set it in, in a the fridge, fridge to chill to for chill. at least an hour. But with most things, yes. overnight is best. So we're gonna let. It's always better the next day. It's I always just better. Made some homemade ice cream. Better the next day. And it's Lasagna. Better the next day. Better the, better next, the day. next Spaghetti. Day. Better the next better. day. Oh, that Watch sounds on this like a, a new segment. What's better the next What's day? What's better the next day? We're going to let our producer... <gasps> see, it's a little bit thin. It's a little thin. But we're going to let our producer, producer try this. And he's going to try and it for us. And if you want to try it with a little cracker. Yeah. If I can get these... Uh, I don't know if I can get them open. There we go. And a little cracker. Well, it looks lovely. And there you go. So it's have a little taste. Lovely and creamy. And we'll get his we'll get his impression. Uh huh. We'll get his impression. And see how it goes. Okay. Oh, thumbs up. The oh, two we get a thumbs, thumbs up. up. That's fantastic. Fantastic, fantastic. One. Okay. Two. So we're gonna thumbs put this up. aside. That's okay. our savory dish. Mmm, savory. We're gonna do a sweet. Yes. I'm excited. We're gonna do our homemade granola bars. Oh, homemade I granola. I love bar. these. So homemade granola. And that's sweet. They're sweet. Okay. They're sweet. Okay. It's it's a low sugar yeah. recipe. Okay. Because um, I haven't been eating refined sugar uh -huh. since January, which you know that. Good for you. So I wanted something though. Sweet. Let's see. What does that do we've for you? We've got some. We've got an man. Uh -huh. The benders are watching the us. The benders are the watching. Benders. Thanks, benders. Thanks so much. Number one for fans. Being with the us benders. Today. Number one fans. Yeah. Fantastic. So I wanted something fantastic. sweet that I could eat that uh, didn't Speaking have sugar of in sweet, it. Sweet. I have a quick trivia. Oh, go for it. Go for it. Um, if okay. can you hear me now? What happened? I feel like we're losing our minds. Sorry, okay. So, we're, we're, anyway, I have, 
I'm sorry to be shuffling. I know it's on your nerve. Okay, here we go. No, it's not. So, um, James A. D. D. E. W. A. R. Dewar. Dewar. Okay. Dewar. Dewar. Born June today. Today. Of nineteen. No, eighteen ninety-seven. Mm-hmm. Okay, today. And today, he invented the Twinkie in 1930. The Twinkie. The Twinkie. While they were doing it, how it happened was they were creating this cream-filled dessert. Uh-huh. They didn't have the filling that they needed to do a um, substitute to do at that time. For maybe like a show or something, I don't even know. <laughs> I, and I can keep tell. My so anyway, <laughs> so what they did, he used a cream field as a substitute for the filling. Ended up, it was popular. The Twinkie and that's was how born. We get the Twinkie. Wow. Yeah. Isn't that fantastic? It's been a long time since I've had a Twinkie. I know. He lived to be ninety-two, and he ate three Twinkies a day. Wow! Wow! There you go. Well, I guess if so you eat your Twinkies. created the Twinkie, yeah, you could eat however many you wanted. Mm -hmm. So this recipe <laughs> has got oats, oats, and peanut butter or okay. any nut butter. It's got a any loop. nut butter. It's got any nut butter, like almond butter, oh, cashew okay. butter, pecan butter. Got it. It's got this one we're making today. It's got cashews and peanuts okay I love but them. you can use any kind of nuts and if you get the recipe you use two cups of what it calls mix-ins and that pecans? can be you can do pecans, I love pecans walnuts i've made but those before Blue pistachios walnuts. okay we're gonna have a little bit of sugar-free chocolate chips okay and some pepitas ah oh, pepita which are pumpkin seeds <gasps> pepita they're really really nice i in love this, a pepita in this. so we have to get everything blended and what origin is pepita? Pepita? It sounds like a Spanish word. It does. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to keep saying it. Pepita. So first we're going <laughs> to... I'm going to just move on. We're going to put one and three quarter cups okay. of oats okay. in my little mini processor. I love your mini processor. Yeah. Maybe just a little bit oh more. My gosh. That's that's close enough. So you have to process it. So we're gonna process it. Okay. Um, you don't have to, but it makes it finer uh -huh. and makes it all bind together better. Okay. So you're gonna put the top on. What's this called? It's so cute. This is my little ninja. It's a ninja. So you just want to. I'll show you because you me. haven't used one before. No, so I you're haven't. just gonna oh. pulse it. Oh. Just about five times. Yeah. Just pulse. Pulse it. Mm-hmm. One, mm -hmm. two, three, four. For the last one. One, two, oh, more? Just one more. Okay, perfect. Fantastic. So, you open it up. I don't think I've ever pulsed a ninja before. No? Wow. No. You do stuff new all the time. All the time. You learn There's things. things you learn things. Studio, so, you? this has got them a little bit finer. You okay. know, not quite to a flower, but okay. a little finer. Oh, you could make an oat flour. Yeah, you could okay. make an oat flour with it. Mm -hmm. Now, we're going to add... Nice. A fourth cup. Uh, so is that a regular blade? Did you do that mm -hmm. one? Oh. Yes, it comes. It's it's like a three part. It comes with a blender uh -huh. and a larger processor bowl okay. and this miniature one. Uh, it's kind of like your Wonder Woman snack. It comes in three parts. Yeah, it is. That's exactly That's right. Fantastic. So we're gonna do one fourth cup of pepitas. Okay. And at the same time, we're gonna add these. Sugar for these chocolate chips are sweetened with stevia. Stevia, it's a lovely name. So lovely we're going to add some of these. You I don't want to use a lot of uh, there's Kenneth. chocolate. There's Kenneth. He's uh, with maintenance. He's in there's our so audience. many people going by. Yeah, it's fantastic to see people going by. Speaking of people coming out. We've got a concert this afternoon. Yeah, we end at four at four o'clock. It's the first live concert. It is the first live so concert. So people should come. Four o'clock in if, the Blue Ridge Room. If they want to come earlier, we have Brain Fitness happening. Oh, Brain Fitness at two thirty. You can't. So you just not have slide it around a little fitness. bit. There you go. Okay, slide it around. And we just want to pulse it a couple times. A couple times. One, two. One more. One more. One more. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Sweet. So we're going to take this off. Take that off. Mm -hmm. Okay. There you uh, go. Okay. Okay. So 
basically what we want is all the ingredients yeah. as the mix-ins. We want them oh, we all. Have more studio we have Jane here. Today. We want Thanks them all here. smaller than <coughs> your fingernail. Okay. Okay. That's our goal. So now we're going to add some you peanuts. You want smaller than your fingernail? The mix-ins. So the, the mix chocolate ins. chips, the pepitas. You need it smaller than your fingernail. Smaller than your fingernail. These are the My peanuts. My fingernail or your fingernail? Either fingernail. Okay. Either one. This, the Someone else's fingernail? A fingernail. <laughs> well, I'm just trying to get uh, a... <laughs> I'm trying to get a measurement so here. When you say fingernail... This, <laughs> in this recipe, we're using... <laughs> Peanuts and cashews. Now, when I, I make these I almost every weekend, I've used pistachios, uh -huh. I've used walnuts, I've used pecans, peanuts, yes. any combination of those things. Okay. So we're going to do a half a cup of right. cashews. Close I love enough. cashews. Close enough. I love walnuts and pecans. I love Is that a good mix? Walnuts yeah. and pecans? That's beautiful. Yeah, I like that. And it's also nice if you toast those first. Oh, Let them yeah. cool you every put time. Sugar on them? No. Not for this recipe. All right. Oh, we have more studio Here audience guests. Chop, fantastic? chop. Oh, sorry, sorry. He's going to chop these things okay. up. Have you ever seen a ninja like this? It's lovely. It's my little miniature. Uh, and you just pulse the top. You ready for it? Pulse. One, two. That's enough. Okay. No. <coughs> All right. Well, if you're here when we're done. Yeah, if you're here when we're done. So we're going to dump this in. So that was one cup of peanuts, half one cup half cup of cashews, cashews quarter cup of pepitas, quarter, and a quarter cup pepita, of stevia sweetened stevia chocolate sweetened chips. Stevia sweetened chocolate chips. And we're going to dump it all in there. Dump it. Okay. Okay. So we've got our mix-ins. Yes. All that. Fantastic. Those on there. That goes there. Okay. There. Okay. So we're done with the food processor. Quaker oats. We're going to put a teaspoon mm -hmm. of cinnamon. That's a half. I got it here. Yep. Sorry. There we go. Mm -hmm. And what I want you to do is take this Danish whisk. Oh my God. Which I got for Christmas. So many firsts for me today. I, I could do a complete I, I like commercial a Danish, I've never on this used thing. A Danish whisk. I have not either until I got it for Christmas. It's wow. just like one of the most amazing kitchen tools. I'm excited. Okay, so I want you to mix all that up. Oh together you get to use it more <laughs> oh my goodness it's fantastic it's fantastic wow fantastic. you just you just mix it knew? you just want to get it yeah kind of incorporated okay. you're so good at that Thanks. i just never seen anybody mix better than you right ever. i know I mean, I mean of course you are amazing oh stop oh now you don't really want me to stop okay okay well. all right that's good so now we've got to add the nut butter. Okay. Now again, when I've made these at home, those are we, some whole nuts. Need do the, you want those in there? Yeah, it's okay. okay. What do we do with our? What let me we? let me rinse off the spatula real quick. So it's okay. the only one I have. Okay. You want me to? Why you? Sure. Talk? You okay. do that because we're going to use it to mix in the nut butter. Okay. So at home, when I've made these, any kind of nut butter, I've even made them with sunflower butter, pecan butter, cashew butter, almond butter. Any combination of those, you need a half a cup. Sometimes I mix the pecan and yes. the cashew together. Okay. You know, you, you can turn this recipe into so many different flavors. Oh, wow. It's delicious. Okay. So dried when I, fruit? You can add a little dried fruit. Yeah. But they suggest no more than a quarter cup because okay. you, you, it'll get way too sweet. Okay. And dried fruit tends to um, stick together. Yes. So you'd have to make sure it's all incorporated. Oh, okay. So you're going to put all of that peanut butter With this? in there. Okay, mm -hmm. fantastic. So we need a cup of peanut butter. And that is pretty much a cup because I made a batch last night and used the other half. Sweet. So you're going to put that in there. While you're doing that. I love peanut butter. I'm going to just drop in a teaspoon I put of peanut butter in my smoothies. Vanilla. I do too. In my protein Almond butter shakes. is really good in smoothies as well. <laughs> Make it sound like I really do a lot of like uh, the two times that stuff. you've the two times the two you've times. made smoothies. Yes. You had yeah, I understand. You know how I did that water thing this morning. Whew. I did it too. It works. So what I did, I went to the grocery store okay. and I looked, you know, how all like a million kinds of water. Yes. So I found a really pretty bottle that I liked. Okay. It had thirty three ounces. Okay. So I like drinking out of that bottle. Yes. I fill that up at night. Uh huh. Drink those 33 ounces yes. before I have my tea. Okay. Every morning. Yes. Every morning. It's fantastic. It's like the best life hack. It is. Ever. 
It is. Okay, okay. so we're just going to do just like a what sprinkle. Am I? Nothing this? yet. Nothing yet. Okay. A sprinkle of salt. Just a, enough? Just a sprinkle. And now we've got. Is a, that the same thing as a dash? Yeah. Okay. Pretty much the same. A dash so now or we're going to add a half a cup of pure a maple dash or syrup. Sprinkle will you, will work. Now, I've made them one time with pure maple syrup at home. The recipe calls for pure maple syrup. This is not the pancake syrup. <laughs> All right, this is from Vermont. <laughs> This so you, is the pure stuff or honey, honey, or I usually use date paste at home. And that date paste. date paste that involves dates and hot water. You pull the pit out and yeah. you process it in your little Sounds machine. Like a lot. It's a lot. Okay. So, um, but I keep some at home all the time. Okay. Well. So you're gonna do a half a cup. Okay. Of pure maple syrup. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> Did I get it? <laughs> I don't you know, just gotta be <laughs> startled me. So you gotta be careful. It so funny. <laughs> it'll just come out of there well, out of nowhere. <laughs> okay. A little bit more. A little more. Well, yeah, we need it to the brim. We need it to the brim. Okay, okay. so there to we the go. brim. To the brim. Now you're gonna take your Dutch whisk. Dutch whisk. I was trying to see if I got it all. I myself. can't tell where it went. Actually, <laughs> may not have gone anywhere. But okay, so I'm whisking. And you're like gonna this. mix it all together so mm. that everything is incorporated. Sweet. Now, what is the explain this Dutch whisk? What would what's it? How is it better than just a regular whisk? Well, a regular whisk yeah. is wires that are curved. Okay. Well, look who's here, oh, Steve Eggles. Steve Eggles. We've oh got to do a do-over. We need a do-over with Steve oh, Eggles. Oh, absolutely. And we should all three of it whisk. do it. We love the whisk. This is fantastic. And I'm not really sure yeah. where that. Uh, idea came from but yes. it's marvelous because when it you is buy good. yeah like fresh nut butter if you buy almond butter cashew so a regular whisk pecan, could be all like all mixed uh, up in the middle okay. yeah yeah this is perfect this is a dutch whisk yeah did you know that there you go yeah. it's all got right. little holes learn something new every day but it's great to mix up your nut butter yeah. before you did eat you know it. that uh twinkie hostess twinkie was an accident Oh, yeah. Today's the day. It was. We learn a lot of stuff on this show. We learn something every time. Yeah, every time. Okay, so you're going to okay. get this all mixed up. Yes. Ta-da. And then we're actually going to set that aside because I made some last oh, night. Oh, we get to taste. And you put them into an 8x8 eight eight or 9x9 nine nine with some parchment paper. Yes, yes, yes. And we're going to pull it out. That's what it looks like. Yeah. So it can come out easier. Oh, Gordy. And it's funny. the recipe actually calls for you to oh. cut this into 16 bars, mm -hmm. but I make it into 64 bites, but we're going to do bars wow. today. 64 bites. And then you put it in your Wonder Woman stackable. Then I put it in my Wonder stackable. Woman stackable. It's fantastic. And it's my, it's, um, it's what I have every morning after my first three classes. It's fantastic. So you just cut them here into fourths. Yes. Just like that. Uh-huh. Can you smell it? Can you smell the peanut butter? I can. Okay. It's amazing. And we're going to cut it here. Everyone is going to want to do this recipe. Oh, yeah. It's, it's a, fantastic. It's a great recipe. It's, it's healthy. better than any granola bar. Anything you can buy in the store. So, I'd like you to taste them. <gasps> yeah. Okay. Taste them. Okay. And you don't have to shuffle. Hey, absolutely. Job. Steve and Caroline. Yeah. Hello. Okay, are we ready? Ready. What do you think? Mm, I have to close my eyes. For That's the fine. With the Tell okay. us the flavors that you're experiencing. Mm. I'm experiencing nuts, peanut butter. Does it taste like it has sugar in it? Mm, it really doesn't. Because it's got maple syrup. It's still going to be sweet though, mm -hmm. right? It's sweet. Steve, would you like to come over Steve, and try one? He, our special come guest on. audience member person. Come on, try one. Individual. I don't know if I had one for it in my life. Uh, mm. Well, you're not, you can't cook anything. Just grab Steve one. Steve Eggles, ladies and gentlemen. Mm. Grab one. Mm. Producer Ed, it. Jane. Oh, have one. Yeah. Come and have one. That's fantastic. Jane, have one. Oh what do you think? Gosh. That's fantastic. You like it? Sugar? It's got pure maple syrup, pure, but no refined sugar. Not uh, Aunt Jemima syrup. So it's healthy. Mm -hmm. It's healthy for you. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's healthy. It's fantastic. Yeah. I'm having a good time getting healthy here. I know. <laughs> right. Right. Oh yeah. Now what you probably need is a big glass of milk to chase that down, with, right? Mm-hmm. So I 
I cut those into little bites, so that would be like four bites, and I have five of those after my morning classes. Five bites after your morning class. With my fresh cold-pressed kale For those of you that are juice. with Caroline, you can have five bites after her class, too. If you make and bring your own. If you bring... <laughs> Yvonne, you yeah, want one? Okay, Did you come get one? You want one, Yvonne? Yeah. Yvonne's in our studio yeah. audience today. We've got a, would you guys like to come get one? Bar? Would you like one? Homemade granola bar? Homemade, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Help yourself. We've got some napkins and some plates. I think this needs to be part of our menu for Olympiacs. Mm. They're good. Morning, morning menu. Here you go. Steve has said Just that he grab thinks these two right it here. should be a part so of you're not our touching anything morning else. menu for Olympiacs. Mm -hmm. So that means the recipe will go to Gordy and his team. Yes, it I will. Know. That'll be awesome. Wouldn't that be nice? They're very Steve, tasty. The mm -hmm. we'll, we'll probably have to have Caroline help us. Well, I can help. We could do it. But they're very tasty. Tasty. Very healthy. You can adjust these to your personal mm -hmm. taste if you mm -hmm. want less peanuts no, we have, or if you want all pecans or all minutes. walnuts. Should we taste the chive? Yeah, let's do a little taste of let's the... Let's do a little chive taste. we got a few minutes left. I'll dish this out and anybody that wants to taste our cream cheese... Mm -hmm. She's going to dish some out. So we want to let you guys know... You want to put some Again, crackers on there? Mm -hmm. Again, <coughs> where's the gloves? Oh, I took mine off because okay. the mine were, sorry. Again, sorry. Uh, this afternoon we've got Caroline uh, Brain Games and um, at 2.30. Then at 4, we've, we've got, got a live concert, the Blue Ridge Room. It's our first live concert, Blue Ridge Room. Um, it's sponsored. Ella, uh, Laurel Lake Music Society is sponsoring it. Masterworks. This is our cream cheese olive dip. Masterworks, uh, Converse College students. Uh, it is a classical concert, piano, violin. If cello. anybody would like to try the cream cheese, come on and get a bite. Gordy, do you want to try? Okay. And then don't forget, okay. there's uh, virtual concerts happening also this weekend mm -hmm. for the 4th. No, yeah, it's this weekend. Yeah, this weekend. Pretty good. Today's Wednesday. Well, this so, resident, this, I mean, I got this recipe from a resident. Yeah, yeah. She shared it. Yeah, there's a few yeah. more things in it, but it's pretty, it's You're very, welcome. very simple. Yep, right here. Oh, absolutely. Yep, yes. granola bars and the cream cheese. We have the recipe. If, uh, if you want oh, the you recipe. You haven't tried it yet. You need to try I know. it. Caroline will send that to you. Uh, what else? Here you go. Announcements, Caroline. I don't Thank know. Thank you, guys. We're just... I don't count We're anymore. out of practice. We <laughs> don't know how to do this. We haven't done it in a month. What else announcements, Ed? Two minutes. We won't have a movie today because of the concert. Great courses tomorrow. And then... New time, 3.30. In the Blue Ridge Room. Be there. What else? I think we're good. Brain Fitness will be around 45, 50 minutes, so we'll be out in time to get set up for the, yeah. the concert. Okay. Come down today. Well, we're going to go ahead and it. say goodbye then. Say goodbye. Okay. Thank you guys for being with goodbye. us. Thank you, Steve. Thank you, Steve. Thank, Thank you, studio you. audience. Thank you, producer Ed. Have a great rest of the day. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.